Hello everyone, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of Project Cat 2011 Professional Edition Tutorial. Uh, it is a back to basic tutorial using modified commands. I'll be bringing forward two modified commands. First will be scale, the second will be stretch. So let's look at our workspace here and draw some entities. First off, I'll draw a rectangular entity or object on my drawing. The second, I would draw some lines objects. Close this. Done. I'll move this object further away. Okay, done. So to execute the command scale or stretch, what I'll do is I will normally go to my top menu here under modify. Under scale or stretch. So let's go for scale. Of course, you can actually also execute it from the toolbar on the side here which is under scale and of course on the command prompt scale or you can actually type sc for the shortcut aliases as uh, scale so okay what does scale do scale is actually scaling the objects or entities or the objects into larger or smaller to a size that you required so let's try one so I have some lines objects here. I will scale all the entities. Once I've selected the entities, what I'll do is I'll click on the base point. Say for example, I'll click on the end point here. And what is the scale factor that you wanted? Well, if it's 0.5, it's actually one time smaller. If it's two, it will be one time bigger. So it depending on what is your size that you wanted. So let's say I want it to be two times bigger. I'll type two, scale factor as two, enter. So this is actually twice bigger than the original object. Let's move out all the way. Okay. So let's copy this. Same. And this time I'll reduce the scale size to one time smaller. Scale. I'll select the entities that I wanted it to be scaled down. And I select the base point. I'll put it as 0 0.5. As you can see, the objects or the entities is actually scaled down one time, which is the original size earlier. And the outer one will be the two times scale of what I've done earlier all right that should take care of scale the second one would be stretch so what is stretch does stretch is actually stretching an object or stretching entities to a different distance I'll show it to you as an example so that you can have officially uh, uh, what you call display here so to execute the stretch command what you do you can actually either go to modify on top menu under stretch or again you can go to the side toolbar under stretch here or you can of course type in the full word or you can actually use the shortcut aliases which is under S to set your shortcut al aliases I have actually made the video earlier but to show you how it was done you can actually go under customization and then aliases so you can actually select just now the S is for stretch so we look for S under stretch all right as you can see so this is a default aliases by project cat themselves is already built in default in the program you can actually change it you have to study or go through my other tutorial to change it if you don't know how to change it so to stretch a object what does it do stretch what you do is select entities to stretch by crossing windows or crossing polygon so we are doing a crossing window here and then once you have selected you click 
or you type enter the enter is actually the space bar on your keyboard or the enter key on your uh, on your keyboard and then a uh, base point or displacement so let's click on the base point now we go for the second base point or displacement if you do not pick on an object you just click any anywhere on the screen it will stretch to the pick point but if you have used the stretch or pick on an object it will actually stretch back to that object so these are the two basic modified commands that I'll bring forward today because I did not want to go further on other commands I try to keep my tutorial short and uh, easy to refer or easy to view alright so I'll see you guys on the next video and take care bye bye